What's up, Cougars? I'm Tony Vito. And I'm Kiana Schlesinger. Today we have some amazing and awesome stories on the Halloween Spectacular and the Jump Rope Club. So why not get started? CMS TV starts now. the season for colds to start kicking in. So how do we prevent them? Gabby Weddings tells us how. <coughs> Getting the cold or flu is never fun, but if you eat the right foods and try not to spread the flu, you are sure to stay healthy. Gloria Arncibia, a nurse at Kaiser Permanente, gave us some insight on how to stay well. Hi, my name is Gloria Arancibia. I'm a nurse at Kaiser Permanente in Panorama City. If you do get a cold or flu, you want to make sure you stay at home if you can um, and not spread the germs by you know, going to school or going to work. So if you do, to prevent the flu or the cold, again, you want to wash your hands. Um, you want to get lots of rest, get enough sleep, uh, eat fruits with vitamin C, drink lots of water, take some medicine. If you follow these simple tips, it will keep you from getting ill. Stay healthy, Cougars. Reporting for CMS TV, I'm Gabby Woodings. The California Shakeout is a statewide evacuation drill practiced by all the schools in the state. Leilani Ingold was there to tell us more about it. We are experiencing an 8.2 earthquake. The command is being issued to drop and hold face away <laughs> from winter. Today is October 20th, 2011, and right now over 8 million people throughout the state of California are participating in the Great Shakeout Drill. The students of CMS are lining up as if a real earthquake has just happened, and some faculty members are participating in search and rescue. The California shakeout happens every year to prepare the people of California for an earthquake that could happen at any second. Castaic Middle School took this very seriously, with faculty members searching every room for missing or injured students. If any were found, they were taken to a holding area where they could be treated for their injury. We were out there for about 45 minutes to make sure that the whole school was clear and ready to move on with the day. The California shakeout was great because now I know if there's a real earthquake, I know what to do. I'm in Mrs. Alexander's advisor class and we just ducked and covered for a big 8.0 earthquake. The California earthquake drill has showed us how to prepare when there's an earthquake, not to panic, and always know what to do when there's an earthquake and the supervisors have helped us know what to do. The California shakeout drill was a success for Castaic Middle School. The students and faculty have learned the emergency process in time of disaster. Reporting for CMS TV, I'm Leilani Ingold. The First Amendment, or Five Freedoms, are a gift from our founding fathers to all Americans. Like any good gift, it keeps on giving by protecting your basic rights. Don't throw your rights away. Cherish them. Use them. Protect them. You're watching CMS TV, Savvy. 
You may know about the Halloween Spectacular or Binge One, but Darren Hames gives us the inside scoop. Awesome stunts, a great story, and a good time for the whole family. That describes the 8th annual Halloween Stuntacular held at the Westfield Mall in Sherman Oaks. Stuntacular was an event held to raise money for the Make-A-Wish Foundation of the Greater Los Angeles area. The show was performed by some of the best stuntmen and stuntwomen in Hollywood. This included several Cal State Middle School students, Kyle Tomlin, Ian Muldoon, and Aaron Miotl. I've been doing the show for three years now. This is my third year. I love every second of it. I wouldn't be doing, I wouldn't rather be doing anything else. Um, it, I love acting and that's that's my favorite thing to do. So to do what I love and to do it for a great cause, I, I would, it's awesome. In the show, I play a character named Kyle just cause they knew I was gonna be it so they named it Kyle. Um, I'm little Sally's brother and Sally, she likes to wear princess dresses and gowns and play with her toys, but people don't think that's cool. So they pick with her, they pick on her, and then uh, we get beaten up by bullies. Well, I do, she's in the background. But um, uh, so then Ron and Hermione come and they take us to the world of Toyland where we have to show all the evil toys there, the power of love and uh, what's so great and not to bully. Before the show, we had the opportunity to talk to some of the actors. What's your job in real life? This is my full-time job. I just go around the world helping people in need. Damsels in distress, little children, I fly. Wherever help is needed, I am there. What's your character in the show? My character is Dirk Danger, world's greatest action figure. Um, what are you doing the show for? The show is to benefit the Make-A-Wish Foundation of the Greater Los Angeles area. How many years have you been in the show? This is my third year, and I plan on being here as long as they'll have me. We also talked to some of the kids that benefited from the work of the Make-A-Wish Foundation. What's your name? Usher. And what was your wish? A tree house. And what was your wish? Um, to meet with Damien Thomason. Um, with the uh, Chargers. Um, how has your life changed after your wish? Um, it, it actually touched me um, when I got to meet him and when I was back in health. Is he your favorite football player? Yes. This year's show was a success. I can't wait to see next year's. Reporting for CMAS TV, I'm Darren Hames. It's easy to dodge our responsibilities, but we cannot dodge the consequences of doing our responsibilities. Josiah Jackal's stamp. Last week, we had an assembly to teach students to stay drug free. McKenna Shaw was there to tell us more. To kick off Red Ribbon Week, Brock Edwards has come to wow us with his feats of magic. Let me tell you a little bit about the teachers again. I need a gentleman to help. Okay, my name is Brock Edwards, and I perform an educational magic show called the Drug-Free Magic Program, and it uses magic, comedy, and audience participation to get uh, kids excited about saying no to drugs. Hi, my name is Mari Dobbs. I really like the magic show, and my favorite part was the magic trick with the ketchup bottle and the brown paper bag. This assembly has taught me a lot about um, saying no to drugs and that it's really important that we shouldn't take them because it can be really bad for your body. The assembly has showed me that drugs are bad for your body and always say no to drugs. No, I'm not talking about the underwater Chinese torture cell. On next week's show, we have Story in the L Awards, a CHP incident that happened over 40 years ago, and a story on a special student who attends Castaic Elementary School. Bye, Bye Cougars! Cougars.